Welcome to Metal Gods TV with Hi, Mick it's the Beer. Hi, again with Colin from Devilman. Hey, how you doing, all right? All right, yeah. Good. I saw you uh, having to duck to come in the door. <laughs> yeah, it's a lifelong problem. <laughs> Pretty used to it. <laughs> And uh, this, um, is this part of the UK tour or is it just a one-off thing? No, we've, it's just uh, the first of our sort of festival dates. Um, we did, at the end of last year, we did a tour with Lacuna Call and um, <laughs> these guys, Promotion, Motionless and White. And um, that was great. And now we've just got a few tours. Obviously, Danny's, uh, he's with Cradle, so he's doing a few shows of that. And then we've got a few more summer festivals. And then we've got a tour at the end of the year. So we're quite quiet this year because we're writing for the next album. So that's where we're at with that. So what do you do when you're not in the band? I work. Oh, I work. Yeah, I work full time. Yeah. yeah, I work as a support assistant for disabled people. Oh, so. that's all right. Yeah, it's fine. That's yeah, right. it's cool. At least it's not boring. It's not very rock star, is it? <laughs> it's not rock star. <laughs> it's interesting. Yeah, it's a good job. I like yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. rewarding. rewarding. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. yeah, the wages aren't rewarding, but no, the job that's is. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, you guys are recording at the moment, or have you got to record a new one? No, we've got we've got another album which is pending for release, I believe, don't quote me on this, I believe it's for the end of next year. Um, we're writing the new albums at the moment, because we just had a lineup change with the other one of the guitarists who, uh, who left just after tour. Um, so that's where we're at at the moment, obviously, like I said, the festival gigs, but the writing stuff's coming along well. I think we're going to try and get to about 25 tracks and then pick the best ones and poo-poo off the rest, really. So, yeah. yeah. So are you here to, for the, are you going to party for the rest of the weekend after you've been on? No, we, we've all got to go back on Sunday, I mean, because um, because Devon in the stage is at the moment, I mean, we still, you know, a few of us still have to work, uh, obviously to pay stuff, and um, we're probably going to leave in the morning, sort of, well, afternoon, maybe 12, 1 o'clock, something like that. Yeah. But, well, so we only just arrived um, at about, sorry, no, about 3 about like midday, so yeah. we've only been here for a little while, so we're trying to settle in still at the moment. So you've just been doing interviews basically since then? This is the first one. First one? This is the oh, first one. Right, and I'm glad. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys, I mean, obviously Danny's the sort of figure, and he's the one who... But, uh, is it on the same sort of spectrum, that you, would you say, is from Cradle? Well, in music terms? Yeah. No, it's, it's quite different. I mean, Cradle's, what you would, well, obviously it's black metal, and would be sort of virgin on the extreme side of, of that sort of thing. Uh, Devon is more, I wouldn't say necessarily mainstream, it's, it's got gothic y dark t tinges to it, but it's much more groove. There's a lot of thrashy and there's some death metal stuff in there. There's not a lot of black metal in there, mm. um, but there's a lot of almost pop stuff as well with the keys and things like that. So we try and create like an atmosphere which would kind of be like a, a darker, Ramstein y kind of thing going on at the moment. So. And do you get good uh, UK reception when you've Yeah, the UK's been good. I mean, they were probably the best crowds on the European tour, were probably the home crowds. Um, London Forum crowd was really good. That was probably, that and Milan were the best two crowds of the tour. Um, but the UK's been good to us. I mean, we were a little bit, you know, especially with Dan, who's obviously fronting the band, the Marmite singer, because, you know, he has yeah. legions of people who just yeah. love it and other people who don't care for it, which is fine, we understand that. But Devon's different from Cradle, it's, it's just not Cradle, and if they're expecting, you know, the, the high-pitched Cradle stuff, it's not going to be there, it's going to be him doing different stuff with us, which is, yeah. which is great, man. You still get the trolls, don't they? Yeah, yeah, they're always just trolls, <laughs> they're always. I would use a really naughty word, but I won't. Yeah, I mean, I mean you see when they announce Bloodstock, it's like, well, if I'm dare playing, I'm not going for it. Oh, I know. I know, it does you nothing, it does you nothing. We get it all the time, we get like, um, Semi skim filth, that was one yeah. I thought was great, <laughs> and just you know, always people just compare it to Cradle, and it's not. But then the album's only been out, um, sort of a few months, so by the time that album's into the cycle, the tour, well, the, the festivals are done, we'll establish ourselves then, and then people will know that it's not Cradle of Filth 2.0, it's definitely so. And you're hoping it's going to lead to you packing in the job or not? Well. Uh, to be honest with you, I think I'll still do that job anyway. Yeah. Uh, something I kind of like, I like doing. So I'll probably still do it, even if it's just part time. But no, nice. It's going well. It's going really well. So. And finally, yeah. Have you got a message for those guys out there watching in La La Land? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Keep keep supporting um, all the bands, whatever genre they're from. Um, you know, the hate's fine, but just remember that they're the ones out there doing it. And you know, I, I've I joined Devonment last year, and I've earned my road stripes in my other band, Conflict Within, and we've been gigging up and down the country for six seven years you know so i know what it's like but just keep at it and be supportive of one another and you know stop all the shit help each other out yeah you know? it's all right. 
Nice to meet you as well. Take care. May God have mercy on your soul.